You're the last one. Complete the mission. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Xtreme Mexical, and welcome back, my boys, to another video, another recipe. And today, my daughter has been asking me for a hot minute to make some mac and cheese. And let's do another mac and cheese recipe, but this time with some cheese differences. Not too much, my dear. So without further ado, let's dive in head first and see the ingredients for this recipe. See you. So we're going to use 500 grams of red Leicester, sharp cheddar, orange. This one is Bianco cheddar. This is the cheddar that I'm going to try a new one. Shredded, I shredded them already, my G. We have, we're gonna use some, and I'm gonna tell you what exactly, some mozzarella to cover the top. So I'm going to use this pasta, and I'm going to use my own bechamel. For, for your own bechamel, you need salted butter, milk, and all perfect flour. And I like to put some noche muscada, ground nutmeg. At the end, when I will put them in the dish, I'm gonna mix a bit of Italian mixed herbs. So those are all the ingredients that you need. Red Leicester or whatever it is, bianco garlic, mozzarella, salted butter, milk, and all purpose flour. And for this recipe you need this type of pasta. I already have the pasta water going on. So now let's flip it and start doing the shit, the bechamel. See you in a bit. So now my jigs on in the water goes salt. And let's cover it up. Now focus on here because we are going to start doing our own bechamel. So here we have the butter, salted butter. Let's switch it on. Let's remove our whisk. This one low heat and let's cut about this. About this cube, See, let's put a bit more just in case. I like to be extreme with my shit. No, 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 that on that one. Now, let me try it again. Move to the other side. My god, that's fucking good salt and butter. You. Let them you need a whisk for this. Let them melt. And it will melt. It will melt completely. Just like that, we're gonna put some oil paper flour, bit by bit. And we're gonna let it be dough. Need more, obviously. As I told you, bit by bit, because you don't know how much you need exactly. Still more to go. Told you, bit by bit, bit by bit, and you are going to succeed in this. Just like that, just a bit more, just a bit more, not too much. It. Now we're going to start putting our milk, bit by bit, again. 
Fuck those people who decide to stick the cap when you open it. I hope they are rotting in hell, yo. This is pure madness. And keep whisking. While this one is cooking the pasta water, the water will be done. How the pasta will be done. I'm gonna keep until it will get creamy or thick. Constantly, constantly keep mixing. Let's put some ground nutmeg. My God, what the open. Some ground nutmeg and let's mix. Look, it's, it's getting thickened. It's I just keep the same process, my geez, for a bit. I will be back with you when it will be done. Not when it will be done, when it's time to put our cheese. See you in a sec. Oh no, my boy. Time to put the pasta in. We're going to put the whole pack. Pasta. The pasta water is ready. Really hot. Excellent. Excellent. Like Shanks from Season MK Mobile. Excellent. We're going to give it a mix. We're going to give it a mix. Let's move back to our bechamel. So we're gonna put like almost the whole the whole carton of milk. Let's put it on. You can you can do it on medium heat if you stay the whole time with it. Even if you put it on low heat, but All right. So see you in a bit, my So I'm gonna put, keep pouring, keep, keep pouring some milk until it's almost done. The curtain. Then I'm going to start putting away cheese. I will show you that in a second. Peace out for now. So no place. The whole carton is almost done. Now the first time we're gonna leave it all dente. We're gonna leave it for seven minutes. So now we're gonna start by putting our cheese inside. Let's put it on medium. Let's start putting our cheese. Whisk, 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 and whisk. You might need to put more milk. You're ready. Already creamy, my dear. So we're gonna need more milk as well. For sure. The whole fucking one liter of milk. Mix it. We're gonna let them melt. Oh, baby! Look at this 
fucking color right here, my boys. Holy moly, boy. Heiser. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Let's put some more Bianco garlic. Just like that. Let them melt. Look at this cream in it, yo. Let me take a screenshot of this. Oh my god. Can you focus on there, please? On there. so I can take a screenshot and stuff like that Let me put some more red cheese red cheddar and we're gonna leave some cheese and some mozzarella to put on top of our shit, of our pasta. Higher temperature because I'm going to constantly with it. This bitch is a big bitch. Tasty. creamy and smooth like butter. Now to make it more creamier I decide to put some mozzarella. Not too much. Not too much and let's mix it. Oh my god. Stay like that. Jesus fuck it I'll be back with you in a second, please. So this is almost done, my cheese. Try now. Mm. 
Leave it like that. The pasta water is done. Just a second, please. And the, the, the recipe is ready. Let me show where the cream is again. Creamy, creamy pasta. So I'm going to see you in a bit. Just let me drink the water and stuff like that. So yeah, my boys, this is done. Creaminess of the pasta, like that. So now let's flip it because I want to put the pasta and and then the dish and put the uh, the shit. See you in a bit. So now, please, if I will put the pasta on here. If I put the pasta in here, I'm afraid that will it will shit. So I put it here. Just like that. I'll put it like that. And like that. Yes, it's hot as a motherfucker. This one is al dente. So now let's start putting our cheese. Beautiful. To the brim. We have some left. That one you can have fun with it later. So now this one is done. Now let's put, let's flip it again. Now, as I said, I'm going to do some Italian herbs, just like that. Let me arrange them just a bit. Now we're going to put it in the oven for about 35 minutes. So now let's cover it with Bianco cheese. Red cheddar and some mozzarella. Just like that, we're gonna cover it up, all of it with cheese, so it will be nice and beautiful. Yo, this shit Bianco cheese is expensive as fuck, but I like it. Full to the brim, no corners. Left to see. Don't leave any corners behind you. And just like that. And this. We clear this shit up. And this thing is done. Perfect. 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 Now let's. Switch on the oven. Okay, let's put it in. Pause. And let's leave it for 35 minutes. So I'll see you in a bit, my Jesus. So it's gonna take a while. So now my boys, here it is. American cheese with the Bianco garlic, 
and stuff like that. Let's cut some American cheese and bam. Oh baby, it's hot as a motherfucker. Okay. Look at the beauty right there in the corner. My God. My God. Okay. So now on top. I'm gonna do more cheese. I'm gonna do Bianco cheese. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Move it a bit down. Perfect, like that. Bam. Okay, move it. Your ass just a bit. Your big ass is on the way. And like that. Top it off with more cheese. Why not? Why not? So yeah, these are the final results of my mac and cheese pasta. So yeah, my boys, I hope you enjoyed this video. That was some mac and cheese pasta, again, but this time with different cheeses. I hope you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, subscribe if you're new, and hit notification bell I don't want to see all my videos. Comment cross right down below, cook next. Share my video to help your boy a lot. Thanks for watching. Am I going to see the next episode? Oh, for damn show. It's your boy X in Mexico. I'm out. Peace! Let's say it together. Bon appetito, bitch! Your boy is out, baby! Stand David to entry team. Your mission's complete. Good job. Head back to talk.